Hey there guys, uh, today I have for you the Sonic and Metal Sonic 2 pack, and I have this shadow, this, uh, single pack shadow. So yeah, uh, I got these just because I heard that there's this new Sonic game called Sonic Genera- Sonic X Shadow Generations. Yeah, uh, so why don't we take a look at this shadow first, the ultimate life form. He comes with a bumper. And, uh, yeah, it's part of the same wave as, uh, Supersonic, Classic Supersonic, and Heavy Gunner, and Menflis. So, yeah, watch that review if you haven't seen it yet, because I reviewed this guy before. He has 11 points of articulation. <clears throat> Sorry. Why don't we talk about, uh, his bio. With his amazing speed and raw power, Shadow the Hedgehog can control time and space with Chaos Control. Chaos Control, yeah. So, why don't we open him up out of the box? Let's open him up out of the box. So, yeah. There he is. Shadow the Hedgehog. And he comes with a bumper. This is a sticker, by the way, and it has a line on it. Hold, plug in the ports and stuff for playsets. Like the Angel's Voyage, which you should watch that one too. I reviewed it before. There we go. Got him on. Got him on the So yeah, this is Shadow. And uh, yeah, he has good articulation. He can rotate his head. Hands can rotate. He has no elbow bends, but you can move around his hands. He has some. You can. He can hold the gun or something because that's what Shadow mainly holds. You can bend at the leg. Yes, you can swivel at the at the. You can. There's a ball joint at the foot. You can move the swivel at the leg, at the knee. 360 right there, and you can also do. You know, you can oops, like sticky or something. It's like stuck. Yeah, you can move the legs. So yeah, his posability is great. Kind of heavy though. He is heavy. That's the problem with all these figures. They're all heavy. They're all too back heavy, so they never can stand properly. So yeah, there's Shadow. So why don't we get out the part I'm excited for? Because I've never gotten a modern Sonic. I have classic Sonic, and I literally have- I've reviewed all the cla modern figures, Knuckles, Amy, and all of them. Yeah, but I've never- I haven't had a- I have an inbox Sonic, just I'm not gonna open it. So yeah. Here we have Sonic, he comes with a bumper too, and we have Metal Sonic, and he comes with a trap button. So yeah, let's get him out. They come in this cardboard box, which is pretty cool, I don't care about it. Why don't we get into the part that I'm excited for? Screw you, Sonic. Mmm. Metallic March Madness. And you know what that means. We're going to talk about uh, Metal Sonic first. So yeah. I have wanted a modern Metal Sonic forever. So yeah. he ha You can move his swivel, his feet. You can bend at the knee. Move the legs around. Move the legs up. Oh no, I broke it. Fucking broke it. Oh no. So yeah, uh broke the leg. Do all of the Sonic figures, the robot Sonics just are suck? Jesus Christ, they all suck so much. They all suck. So he's got a swiv head swivel and uh you move his hand joints. And I'm kind of at a loss for words right now, because I broke it. I broke it. I fucking broke it. Uh, so you can, you can twist the arm, and, uh, yeah, it'll, his arm only twists out to the side for some reason. I don't get that. Like, I'm not joking. He can only just, like, twist it to the side. He can't, like, twist it up, forward. He has to do it to the side. Oh my god, I broke him. <laughs> no. Oh, I think I can glue it or something. I think I can glue it or something. 
Damn, that really sucks, though. I wanted this figure for a while, but I broke breaking the first day I get him. Son of a bitch. And his paint kind of looks bad. So yeah, there's Metal Sonic right there. He has nice bottom shoe detail, which you can see with the broken fucking leg I got. So yeah, nice clicking button right there. Nice clicking button. Got Robotnik's dumbass face on it, because, I don't know, Robotnik's... Robotnik's robots didn't even get destroyed by Sonic. I destroyed it. You suck, Robotnik. Ugh, that gets me mad. Except been waiting for this thing forever. I wanted it. And I broke it. God damn it. Now I'm gonna have to fix that. I'll fix it later. Later today. Heh, <laughs> why don't you go call the uh, fucking their quality control? Because, you know, fucking broke it. Alright, so why don't you take a look, compare these two springs that I got? This one's definitely uh, more centered than this one. And there's a thicker line on this one than this one. Yeah, so this is... Oh, they actually work as springs, as bouncers. You can push them in. So yeah, that's cool. So why don't we take a look at uh, Sonic himself. So yeah. He has his classic shoes, they've never released his soap shoes, if you're wondering what they are. They're the Sonic Adventure 2 shoes, which everyone's like, you know, Oh, I want the Sonic 2 shoes, they look better than these shoes! And I'm like, I don't care, their shoes are shoes. So yeah, all the same articulation as uh, Shadow. He can stand better, better than Shadow, but that's probably because his quills are shorter. And you can also do the pose that they did in Sonic, Sonic Adventure 2. Shit like that. Get over here, Shadow. Yeah, look at him. Brothers. Brothers. Oh my god, I'm so mad right now. Why? Why, dear lord? Why? Why have you forsaken me? Look at his leg. Oh, I broke it off. Oh, I feel like Al from Toy Story when, when you know, Woody's arm fell off. Ugh, now I have to fix it. God damn it. I broke it. It makes me so mad. Now I have to fix it. See so yeah. it. That was my... Uh, they're good toys. They're good figures. Except for you, because you broke on your stupid like leg out of here. Still pose him, at least. See so yeah. it. Oh, that was my review on Modern Sonic and Middle Sonic and Shadow. Thanks for watching. Bye. Hey there, guys. Uh, so this is a. Uh, uh, yeah. So I want to talk about something about this Sonic the Hedgehog. Uh, you look at him; he looks fine and normal. By the way, this is like a day after recording the Sonic and uh, Metal Sonic review two pack. So I have not received my replacement Metal Sonic because he broke. Yeah, I'm still... This is, I just found this out after, you know, watching someone else's review on this. You look at him, he looks fine and normal. You know, nothing too out of the ordinary. And then you look... Just look a little bit closer at his eyes. I have an inbox Sonic. I just have an inbox Sonic the Hedgehog just because I found an infinite. And this guy was standing right next to him, so I bought both. And yeah, I found an infinite. And so I got this guy. I see. Look at him. Look at their eyes. Their eyes are not the same. This guy's is a flip. They're like, you know, not, they're not the same. And this guy, Sonic, looks normal. Looks like the image. I don't know. Is there just, and his eyes look bigger for some reason. His eyes, his, like, black pupils look bigger than the others. I don't know. That might just be me. Or something, or just because this is like from an earlier wave and they just shoved it in a package. But I don't know. So yeah, I'm still angry, and the paint on this Metal Sonic looks horrible. You can see right there, it's not supposed to look like that. It looks uneven, and his back looks terrible. I don't think it's supposed to have all that silver shit on there. So yeah, oh, I just learned that. 
I'm not gonna open this guy up and review him, by the way. I just wanted to keep him in the package, because, I don't know, I want a Sonic in the box. And he comes with a skateboard, too, so yeah. Wait, what? It's weird. Eh, who cares? Oh yeah, also, uh, this, uh, Metal Sonic only can rotate. They, like, made it, you can see in there. They made the joint, like, go out to here. He can only bend his arm out, which is a problem with all the Metal Sonics, I know. But this arm, you can bend it forward, but you can't move the joint, so, you know, you can't move the elbow joint to the side, so he can't, like, have both arms out. You only have this arm out and this arm this way so i don't know what's up with that seems like garbage seems like a rubbish and this is actually the very first time i've gotten a jack specific figure which i'm not happy about like i don't know they failed with this it sucks they did good with this guy and he was like later i think he was later in the line so that probably makes sense Still, I never had anything fall off of this one, but this one, his leg fell off. I don't know. Yeah. Or like this guy, I reviewed him, and uh, his leg got stuck, but it was an easy fix, because I had long ass nails, so I could just, you know, get in there and fix his knees. Loosen up his knees. So yeah, I don't know. Seems like bullcrap, and I'm mad now. And I hope to soon get my replacement Metal Sonic, Modern Metal Sonic. Because, uh, I really need it. Where is he? Let me just get out the bucket. Here he is. I haven't reviewed him before, but here's classic Metal Sonic. I'm just gonna talk about him right now. He's basically a tinier version of Modern Metal Sonic, but, you know, stylized from Sonic CD. He has basic, uh, 2.5 inch figure, you know, material, joints and stuff. He has no elbow bend, no knee bend. You can move his legs. Twist his head a little. But yeah. This thing, I got from eBay, by the way. I got it from eBay. Like, 10 bucks is better than the thing I paid 17 bucks for. These two. I paid 17 bucks for this. And these suck. I gotta say the only thing good about them is this. It's the button. Oh yeah, wasn't this a shadow review? Should be re I should talk about shadow too. So yeah, um, I like shadow. I'm excited for his part in the new generations game. And yeah, so yeah. That was uh, my extended review on uh, the Jack specific Metal Sonic and uh, Sonic the Hedgehog 2 pack. Thanks for watching. Bye. These guys are rubbish. 0 out of 10. Uh, bye.